So I managed to make Roblox's first autonomous car, but how did I manage to get here? But before we see the whole thing, let's take a look at how I made it, shall we? So how do you think I was able to pull this off to achieve this? Well, how about let's break it down and I'll show you what it's made of. All right, so my script is built up of three things. Number one, external input. It needs this in order to detect the lines so it knows when it should turn and how much. Two, it needs a chassis. Well, values that go into a chassis. See, this script can't control a chassis directly, so we need well, external values outside of a chassis and a script inside of a chassis that makes the wheels turn. Then three, it needs, well, the script. It needs to do the math, and then it will determine whether or not it will turn. It's that simple. But how did I implement it? That's what we're talking about. So now that we know how the script works, how do we figure out what it's doing in real time? Let's find that out too, shall we? So just for comparison, these are the main sensors and these are all of the sensors. Pretty crazy, am I right? It also has this little sensor right here. But despite all of that, it was incredibly simple. I mean, think of all these other people using rays and all sorts of devices like that. All I had to do is use a little touch sensor and that's all that was needed. See, it has two touch sensors. There's one actually on both sides that is just a normal turn. And then there's one that's close to the car on both sides. That's a larger turn. So on the exterior, on the outside layer, we'll say, they're layers, it will turn a little bit to adjust to a small curve in the road. But if the line gets really close to the car, they'll turn a lot to compensate for that. And that's all you need. But it's important that you don't overdo it either. I mean, you need to make something needlessly complicated, but I also failed at that while I was creating it. But let's not talk about that. But after explaining that all, let's get into showing you guys what the final product was. anything but remember if you're not having fun you're not playing you're working 